We begin tonight with a mother accused of stealing her own baby from the hospital and stabbing three nurses. The suspect's mother tonight spoke exclusively to Ari Height about her daughter and says this story is more than what it seems. Ari joins us now from Palms West Hospital with the details. Ari. And the baby in the middle of this, Felicia, is now four days old. Her name is Princess. Her grandmother tells me that Princess is still here at Palms West Hospital. She is doing much better. She hopes to take Princess home sometime next week. As for Princess's mother, well, she is now in jail, but her family tells me they do not believe she's a criminal. They say she's just mentally ill. This is how most people first saw Kendra Green her mugshot, but her mother says this is the real Kendra Green, a college graduate who wanted to work in an agricultural lab. Beautiful girl, likes to dress up just like any young 20 year old girl, like to put on her makeup, happy go lucky girl. Police say Thursday night Green walked into Palms West Hospital and took her three day old daughter out of the intensive care unit, stabbing three nurses who tried to stop her. That is a bomb. <laughs> exploding right there and that's what happened. She exploded. Dion says Kendra was diagnosed schizophrenic three years ago. Medication helped, but Kendra stopped taking the meds just before she got pregnant. Dion says at 41 weeks, Kendra's mental health had significantly deteriorated. She will pass her due date now. So because she passed her due date, her hormone is like double raging because she way past her due date. Dion says she tried calling multiple hospitals, law enforcement, nobody would help. She finally got Kendra checked into Palms West Hospital on July 7th, where she says Kendra had two mental breakdowns. And I'm like, I hate you, I hate you. And they'll start screaming and crying like a mad person on the top of her voice. Dion says Kendra only got worse after the baby princess was born and placed in ICU because she was too small. Dion has since learned Kendra thought Princess was in danger. She said the hospital kidnapped her baby and she's going to get her baby one way or another from the hospital. And Dion says that is what led to Thursday night. She hopes people can see her daughter isn't a criminal. She just needs help. When people do stuff like that, you don't go lock them up in prison. Prison is not the place. She needs to go into a psych hospital. Again, Kendra Green remains in jail tonight. Her bond was set at $300,000. She is facing a long list of charges, including aggravated battery and aggravated child abuse. Reporting live in Loxahatchee, Ari, High WPBF 25 News.